everyone. Hey everyone. Speaking with us today is Dr. Alex Abramson, an assistant professor in the chemical and biomolecular engineering department, who is featured on the Forbes 30 under 30 science list and the MIT Technology Review Innovators under 30. Joining us today is Ms. Isabella Yang, a graduate student and PhD candidate. Speaking with us today is Dr. Josh McElbert, director and co-founder at Stanford Bio Center for Biodesign at Stanford University. School of Medicine and a Boston Scientific Applied Bioengineering Professor of Medicine and of Bioengineering at the Stanford University Schools of Medicine and Engineering. Uh, my lab develops ingestible, implantable, and wearable robotic therapeutic devices. And specifically, we focus on uh, improving patient adherence to different drug regimens. Uh, we also work on creating therapy automation meaning uh, creating new types of sensors and drug delivery devices uh, that automate the process of uh, taking your drugs, uh, and also facilitating preclinical drug screenings for chronic diseases, uh, such as diabetes, heart failure, and cancer. In our lab, we develop mostly wearable sensors for health monitoring in a very non-invasive and continuous way. Biodesign is a program at Stanford which trains people to do basically what I've done for a living, um, identify problems, figure out a framework for solving them, invent solutions, and then create the right framework to launch them as companies or products or what have you um, within bigger companies. Well, probably the most exciting thing uh, that's happened to me during my research career has been uh, getting some of the devices that I've worked on into clinical trials. Uh, and so the pills that are able to deliver insulin uh, and other macromolecules orally. Those are currently in clinical trials, um, and those clinical trials are sponsored by Novo Nordisk. Um, and so one of the things that uh, you know, has you know, gotten me to that point um, was doing a lot, a lot, a lot of testing in the lab. I really love the idea of combining science and um, engineering and math and all these things to actually making a positive impact on the world and, and improving people's lives. And um, I, I fell in love with the idea that you can just design things, like make things that work and that people interact with. And that was really, really cool. And, you know, we go to these classes, like, why am I in this class? What am I learning? Every, you know, all that kind of stuff. Like, what, how is this going to relate to me? Why do I need to know about cosines and sines and, you know, triangles or whatever, what have you? And, uh, and then you realize at some point, like, whoa, actually the whole world is built on this. Like everything, the, the chair you're sitting on, the desk, the car, the plane, the television, the computer, it's like all engineering and engineers basically create the world. And so, you know, if you want to build something about that, that actually works and can be a part of the world and change the world and being an engineer is like the way to go.